For this video review, we're going to take a look at McFarlane DC Multiverse Green Lantern Hal Jordan Gold Label, the latest one. Okay, so let's do a quick 360 of the box packaging for easy identification on the toy aisles. So this Hal Jordan action figure is a remod or reuse of this action figure. Dark Knight's uh, Metal um, 2 figure set of Batman Earth 32 and Hal Jordan Green Lantern. Okay, so let's compare these two figures. Okay, so first let us measure this guy up as for height. So just below 7.5 inches. Okay, so let's do a 360 turn of the action figure so we could really take note of all of the details the paint job the head unit and the hand sets but the mold it's just one and the same okay so hand sets are fists the other unit is going to have accessory holding hands which actually makes the length of the arms for this action figure shorter because of the fist handsets but the pegs are actually still the same okay so let's bring in the other figure okay, guys so we have the other figure the other Hal Jordan Green Lantern figure to compare so as you can see just the difference in head sculpts and of course, the difference in the shape or the pattern of the mask. Well, it's very obvious with regards to the paint job. So this sports a flashier green paint job, which really makes this figure dull. But still a great looking uh, Green Lantern action figure. So handsets as i pointed out earlier so these are accessory holding hands those are fists so let's do for comparison from this angle and let's do a comparison from this angle and i already subjected this action figure to really high rubbing with my thumb because the McFarlane DC Multiverse um, Cyborg action figure which I just recently reviewed about last week um, the paint job on that action figure really flaked out of packaging but with this action figure so I've been rubbing this figure and been playing with it for quite some time before I um, made this video so I could tell that this paint job on this new action figure holds on pretty well okay so we don't have any paint issues okay so also diff um, difference um, the camera really can't um, catch it as well as the naked eye this has a shinier black to it compared to this this is matte black this is matte green this is shinier so compared to the forearms too okay so very slight difference <laughs> so it's going to be um, personal choice of the collector um, mold well great looking action figure um, things that I would change or would have wanted would be a bigger set of um, fit for these action figures because somehow those are still very small um, I would have wanted standardized um, boots something of uh, this nature okay so let's bring button down so these boots would have really been better for these two action figures so that's from my custom Batman action figure, McFarlane, from the Flash movie. Okay, so that's it actually. 
I could really not make so much complain about this because um, with the newer variant so actually it's a just a bit of a step up but not really a big difference with regards to um, really making you want to purchase another Hal Jordan action figure but for example you don't have this in your collection then I would really recommend getting this action figure as for accessories well the ones that um, this figure has and the accessories that this figure has actually you could really not tell them apart but if you have them both then you could make use of <laughs> but possibly interchange them if you um, if you wish but oh yeah okay so here's the difference it's going to be just a little bit of shade so this now I know belongs to this set so this the color is slight just slightly different that's it slightly bit different but not so much yeah okay so now I could tell that yeah they could tell them apart okay so with regards to the shade as you could see um, i hope that the camera catches it this time okay so darker lighter color darker lighter color so you know that this set belongs to this figure this set belongs to that figure okay so as for judgment purchase or not depends on you personally whether you want to add a new McFarlane uh, new um, Hal Jordan Green Lantern action figure well, because the page about well, this is really good <laughs> that's it it's uh, it really looks good um, even um, just by looking at it so in box or in out of box more out of box this figure really shines differently especially with that new head unit so if you like this review like comment and subscribe to help me grow my channel and see you on the next action figure or custom action figure review